everybody, it's Mr. Simpson here and welcome to Mr. Simpson Storytime, story time number 54. It is a Friday, I've got my headphones on, but I have had a request today from a wonderful young man by the name of Elliot and his message sounded something like this. Hello Mr. Simpson, it's Elliot here. Will you do me a shout out and do me a story and do me a rap? So how could I resist you Elliot? Absolutely, this is for you. So I am today going to attempt to rap and I'm being very heavily emphasizing the word try. We should always try. Um, I'm going to try and do for you today the dinosaur that pooped the past. That's right. <laughs> okay, here we go. Wish me luck. And thank you to Daisy who's be I behind the camera. Thank you, Daisy. Say hello, Daisy. Hello. Hello. Here we go. Some grannies are old. Some grannies are great. And Danny's was turning 1008. He sang happy birthday with Dinosaur too. Then asked to go out. There was playing to do. You cannot go out so your plates are all clean, said Granny while serving up sludge that was green. There were broccoli eggs and hard Brussels sprouts. The dinosaur slopped the lot into its mouth. Then, in the two seconds when Gran wasn't looking, it ate Danny's pile of awful Gran cooking. Well done, Granny said. You've eaten enough. Now you can go out and do some cool, awesome stuff. They ran straight to the tree with a swing underneath, but it hadn't been swung since Gran lost her teeth. They swung back and forth. They went up, they went down. Higher said Dan, let's go all the way round. But there just wasn't an ordinary swing. It had powers, powers to turn back the minutes and hours. They counted to three and pushed hard off the ground. They looped and they looped and they turned time around. Their heads went all dizzy, time started to bend. So Danny held on to his dinosaur friend. Flashes and fizzes and sparkly squeaks. They swung past the Romans, Egyptians and Greeks. Then with a crack, the swing snapped in half. They crash landed in a land from the past. Surrounded by trees of a Jurassical size. Being watched through the trees by mischievous eyes. Then three baby dinos jumped down to Awesome Lee. Who called themselves Dino Dudes A, B and C. They liked playing games like Stackety Stack. With Dino Dudes A, B and C on its back. Then suddenly dinosaurs tummy made grumbles. Grumbles and rumbles that made the ground crumble. But grunts don't crumble for any your reason. Grounds only crumble in volcano season. We swung back in time, we were trying to play, said Danny to Dino Dudes B, C and A. We need to get back, we need to leave fast, we need to get everyone out of the past. But Danny and Dinosaur's only way back was looping through time with a swing that had snapped. The lava was coming, the lava was hot, even hotter than Granny's old veg cooking pot. And so without thinking, B, C and A stacked themselves up in the game that they play. But this wasn't a game, it was saving the day, saving the day, the Dino do way. They flipped and they jumped through the jungle with ease Surfing the lava on lava proof leaves Gathering all of the things they would need To fix the time swing at the speediest speed Wax from the bees, sap from the trees A touch that fell off when an old mammoth sneezed They bashed it together with stegosaur teeth While dodging explosive eruptions beneath The swing had been fixed but the dinosaur group Were now far too heavy to time travel loop Dan started to worry then started to panic The ground underneath was now hot and volcanic They all started to cry, they cried and they cried They cried and their tears instantly vaporized Then something went ping in the dinosaur's mind He thought of a way to look forward in time we broccoli eggs in the dinosaur's gut its brain brewed a plan involving its butt it knew there was only one thing it could do to get back to the future it needed to poo The poop came out fast, it had broccoli power and launched them 88 miles per hour. It pooped out a pile of grand soggy egg veg with Dino Dudes A, B and C on its head. It pooped and it looped them all forward in time away from volcanoes and hot lava slime. The Romans and Trojans were covered in poop. They all got a taste of grand broccoli soup. Whilst looping through Egypt, it pooped out a pile which made a poop pyramid next to the Nile. It plopped out the sprouts, it's bundled a smelly and looped out the last piece of poop from its belly. They fell out of time, they made it back home But Danny and Dinosaur were on their own Dino dudes A, B and C were there too They travelled through time on the broccoli poop They all started cheering and jumping around It seemed like new dinosaur friends had been found And just when they all had more veg they could take Birthday Grand served up a broccoli cake Boom! 
I hope you really enjoyed the dinosaur that pooped the past. I'll see you on Monday. Have a lovely weekend. Bye!